Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be another collab with some other ladies on the YouTube Mommy Meetup. This collab was organized by Rachel from Day to Day Joy, so be sure to go check her channel out and all of the other ladies who are participating in this collab today. I will leave a playlist link below so you can check out all of their videos. And if you are new here, hey, my name is Rachel. I make videos on all things motherhood, homeschooling, um, natural living, sewing, DIYs, crafting, essential oils, you know, pretty much whatever pops into my head, I'll make a video about. But today's video is called All Things Pumpkin. Myself, including all of the other ladies, are going to be making videos about pumpkin recipes or really anything pumpkin. Pumpkin is super hot this time of year. There's pumpkin spice everything. And the thing that I'm making is not too far out there. It's something that I know you're going to want to try. Today I'm going to be making pumpkin spice honey butter. And it can be placed on anything as simple as toast or a muffin or a waffle. I just thought of the waffle idea just now and that sounds like a divine idea but I thought it might be fun to make a big batch of this and take it to anyone's home who you'll be visiting in the next couple of months, whether it's for a party or a get together or just as a nice little gift. It's so delicious and so simple and you can have it year round. So let's go ahead and jump right in to my recipe for pumpkin spice honey butter. We're going to need two sticks of butter, pumpkin puree, honey, cinnamon, pumpkin pie spice, and vanilla extract. Here is a really cool hack I learned on Pinterest. If you wanna soften up your butter, just take a measuring glass or a bowl or something and run hot water in it. And if you want it even hotter, you can microwave the bowl of water to make it hotter. And then place that bowl or measuring cup on top of the butter and it softens it so much quicker without melting it. So I'm gonna start here by putting the butter into my mixer. And now I'm adding the honey. This is one of my Pampered Chef measuring cups and I love it for things that are kind of mushy and don't do well in regular measuring cups. Here I'm adding the pumpkin and my vanilla extract. And now adding the cinnamon. And arguably the winner and hero of this recipe, the pumpkin pie spice. Now I have to be honest with you, this is the very first time I've made this. So you're watching this happen in real life. <laughs> and I started with this whisk attachment thinking that it would be the best way to get the butter nice and whipped. But as you can see as you watch, it didn't quite turn out like I thought. And honestly, at this point, I wasn't too impressed with how this mixture looked. So I decided to switch out the whisk attachment for the paddle attachment on my KitchenAid mixer. This attachment has a, like a silicone scraper on the side of it. So it scrapes the bowl as it goes around. And this looked much better, much more like the actual picture on Pinterest. And see how whipped it is? It's beautiful. And after it was finished and looked the way I wanted it to look, and honestly, after a few tastings, I transferred it to this glass storage container. And these are the snapware ones that I really love. And of course, I had to try it. I mean, it's a service I'm doing for you guys, right? I put some of this uh, pumpkin spice honey butter on a piece of gluten-free white bread and oh my goodness, 
I mean, it just looks delicious, all melty and gooey. Oh. And this does keep in the fridge for a couple of weeks. So you could just leave it in there and enjoy. So I hope you enjoyed this video today. If you did, please be sure to give me a thumbs up. And if it's your first time here, please hit that red subscribe button so that you can see all of the videos that I have coming your way here in the next couple of months. And of course, leave a comment below. What is your favorite pumpkin spice thing? Or if you're not a pumpkin fan at all, that's fine too. What is your favorite thing to eat this time of year that maybe you kind of save for the fall? And also be sure to check out all the other ladies who are doing videos about this topic today. I will leave their playlists linked below. I hope you're having a wonderful day and go make you some honey butter. Bye.